welcome to my channel if you are new here hello you are spiritually connected with katiba that's for sure look <laughs> the odds were against you yet you still conquered like what where they do that at like who does that like who's really as bossy as you like who's really as highly favored as you like who's really a chosen one like you like literally where you come from literally your hometown literally the type of school you went to the type of education that you got literally the type of downline that you uh come from like literally your family legacy all of the generational cycles everything was like the color of your skin like come on now literally it's so many things that says you're not supposed to be where you are today. It's so many things that saying you were supposed to be in those same cycles as well. You were supposed to keep it up, but yet you're actually here breaking generational cycles, like one cycle at a time. The odds were put against you People like you aren't supposed to be where you are today. The type of things that you have already accomplished, people like you wasn't supposed to accomplish them. You were supposed to stay where you was at. I'm going to just be honest. Like society says, like uh, statistics say that you were one of those ones that was supposed to be like the rest. Like you supposed to be still where you were growing up. Like, who said that you can make it out? Who said that? Like, you were supposed to be that parent, that emotionally unavailable parent as well, because your parent was that. Like, who said that you're supposed to be available? Like, who said that you can break that cycle? Like, what is it? It's something that you're going through. It's something that you have conquered. <laughs> it's something that you have conquered and you wasn't supposed to. The odds were against you, but yet you remain humble. You fought through it. You bumped your head. You had many, 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 many lessons and you still going through stuff. But you still like, you're still able to withhold yourself. You still able to have your peace. You still able to be sane. Like you got your sanity. Like who does that? As much stuff as you uh, have been through, like, people, like, a lot of people don't make it out. As much stuff as you have been through behind closed doors and in front of people. Because a lot of people know your story. People who know you personally, they know your story. They know where you come from. There's a lot of people who still, you roll through your old neighborhood and you see the same people. And you say, oh, man, they look crazy like for real for real a lot of people out here looking crazy you supposed to be that person out here looking crazy too you supposed to be that person out here and then lost your mind too by now after all you've been through you still got your mind people see you they see it and this is why they like well we know who you are and you like oh no you don't know who i am <laughs> It's people from three months ago who don't know who I am. Like, you're constantly evolving. You're constantly changing. People can't figure out, like, how you're doing that. The odds were against you, yet you're, you still conquered. Like, you're conquering. Like, you're a warrior. Like, you're fighting. Like, you didn't fought the toughest battles. And, I mean, you just been, you been knocking them out. I ain't gonna lie. Like... Yeah, you been getting knocked. Yeah, you been getting got slapped upside your. Of course, you didn't got knocked down so many times. I'm not saying that, but somehow you always find a way to get back up. Like how, Sway? How? How are you that highly favored? Like how are you that divinely protected? Like come on now, you a chosen one. It's clear as day. It's clear as day that you're a chosen one. 
like all of the battles that you have been through, all of the things you had to get through and go through and grow through, like all of the times where you done been down and out, all of the tears, <laughs> like what? You did that. And when people look at you, they can't even tell. That's the funny thing. Like if you used to tell people your story, oh yeah, I have slept on the floor before. <laughs> like, oh yeah, I done been homeless. Oh yeah, but I didn't ain't had rent money. Like, oh yep, yeah, I ain't had grocery like I used to steal. Like, yep. Like when you get to tell the people the, the the little things that you didn't been through. Like, yep, I didn't slept on somebody's couch. Uh-huh. Like, yep. I didn't move back in with my mama. Yep. I sure did. Yep. Like, when you get to tell the people your stuff, like, yep, I've had a near-death experience. Like, yep, somebody tried to take me out. Like, yep, car accident. Yep, yep, yep. Like, whatever it is. Yep, I didn't move from my hometown. Yep, I didn't move from my home com country. Like, <laughs> when you get to telling people that, like, yep, I escaped. Yep, I escaped poverty. poverty. Like, yep, mm-hmm. Like, yep, parents used to be on drugs. Yep, mm-hmm. Like, yep. In a drug house. Yep. Uh, like, people don't believe you. People don't believe you because you don't look like what you've been through. Like, somehow, some way, somehow, we got the higher power working with you on your side. And, like, you only starting to look better. Like, the more that you age, the better that you're looking. Like, you're, you're not looking older. You're just looking more wiser. Like, because you are. Like, you've gained so much wisdom through everything that you have been through. A lot of it, it was tough. But a lot of it, you lightweight, cool with it happening because you recognize, like, wow, it has made you into the strong warrior that you are today. Like, now you got thick skin. Like, now you know how to fight battles. Like, you know how to get through stuff. You know how to, like these certain things have helped you with your mental health like i said stuff that turn people crazy you done been through enough you done had to go through and grow through enough of it to that you're able to go through things now but you're able to get through it like you're able to work through it everybody can't do that you done been through some of the toughest stuff like and it might not have been physically. Sometimes it's all mental. It's all emotionally. Like you didn't had to fight with your demons. You didn't had to fight with your shadow self. You didn't had to. You had to face it. But that's the problem. A lot of people don't face their their darkest sides. Like you recognize that you have a dark side. That you got an ego. And your ego is not you. You recognize that your ego is not you. So anytime that ego try to take over, you like, no, nah, ego, this ain't what we doing. Anytime that mind try to take over, your soul jump in like, no, nah, this ain't that. <laughs> this ain't that. Like, this is these are the type of things that you're learning. So you don't take, like, any losses or anything that you had to go through as, a bad thing or a terrible thing i'll say it's like no you learn from that you would rather have went through that than to put your child through that like you would rather had learned that before you did something bigger that could have blew up even worse like <laughs> you recognize that things could always be worse like and there's people situations that are worse off than yours so you don't like per se regret certain things, but you like learn that you see the lesson and you see the value in actually going through that because it's some stuff that you'll never go through again. You'll never go through it again because you went through it because you didn't been there and done that and you know how it feel and you never want to be there again. And you never want to, put your family in certain situations or you would never want to like whatever it is whatever it is yes you're still bumping your head 
yes, you're still learning lessons because the thing is, it's like uh, shadow work. It's never going to stop. It's not going to go anywhere. It's like problems. Like we're all going to have them. But you, you've learned how to deal with your stuff better. And you're learning constantly how to deal with your lower self better, with your shadow self, with your your battles, like even better. And this is why you stay winning. And this is why you're constantly like conquering the world. Like you out here looking like Superman on them. <laughs> you out here looking like Superman to the average person. They like, there she go again. Like, there he go again. I, I thought you fell off. Like you still doing your little thing. I, I thought you fell off. I can't believe you're still doing your thing. <laughs> But man, you still conquering. I'm so proud of you. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie because when I tell you life be life <laughs> and life ain't easy. But you just like you go through stuff, but you like, no nah, man, life gotta go on. I mean you here to live. <laughs> you here to live. You like, I'm not about to be, I'm not about to let this take over. I'm not about to let this take over. And i tell you one of the toughest things I had to deal with. <laughs> and I don't even go here because I ain't trying to get emotional. But I'm going to tell you one of the toughest things I had to deal with. My mother passed away. But let me tell you, when I tell you, like, what I took out of that and what I got out of that, it's like, it's nothing that can hurt me any worse like it's nothing I can't get through it's nothing it's nothing that's going to make me feel like life is over because I was able to get through that and I didn't go into like no deep depression or anything like I recognize that because I like just from within just like being with myself and connecting with my higher self and facing myself <laughs> And being with God is like, I recognize that we're just here temporarily. Like our soul lives on. So when I recognize that, it's like, it ain't nothing that can tear me down to where I feel like life is just over. It's nothing that can do that. Cause that was the toughest thing I've ever had to deal with. And I, and I dealt with it I'm still dealing with it, but I'm dealing with it so well. I'm dealing with this so well. Like, I had somebody literally tell me, like, oh, if it was my mom's funeral, I, I like to not have showed up. Like, some people really can't take it. Like, some people really, when their loved ones pass on, they may take their self out. But you, you done been through some of the toughest things, and you're still conquering, you're still prevailing, like, you're still proceeding that's a beautiful place to be in. I'm not gonna lie. That's a that's a really like dope place to be in on a mental level. Like mentally, you got it. Mentally, you got it. Like you're you're on track. <laughs> you're in the right direction. Because sometimes you up, sometimes you down, sometimes you winning, sometimes like you're you're just, it's just a bunch of lessons. But I'll tell you what, you're being prepared for something, something so great. And because you've been able to get through all of this, you're showing the universe like you're ready. <laughs> you're ready. Like you're ready. It's only a matter of time before things is just so great that all of them losses, all of those lessons, they don't even matter anymore. They won't even matter anymore. Like... And you're gonna be so grateful for each and every one of them. Because when you, when you like, when you in a, a nice groove, <sighs> sheesh, I just lost my train of thoughts. But anyway, I'm just gonna go end it right here. <laughs> I'm gonna just go ahead and end it right here. Cause I feel like I've said enough. I feel like I've said enough. So look, 
if this video resonates, if it hit different, let me know how so in the comment section below. Let me know all of your thoughts in the comment section below. Chosen one, star seeds, claim your badge today. Let me know, let us all know that you're part, like that you're a chosen one. Get your badge, your membership badge, 99 cent. Let us know that you're a chosen one. All the chosen ones are getting it. Get your membership badge. Stand out in the comment section. Look like it look as good. It look as good as you, okay? <laughs> I'm not gonna even lie. If you're new here, I do invite you to hit that subscribe button. That's all I have for this video. Stay spiritually used, stay spiritually into. And I'll see y'all in the next one.